Hey everybody, so I'm back with the second tray of the Candid Co. Um, wanted to do a review on it. So I did have a little bit of a mishap that happened um, about a week ago. Um, plus, this last week's been pretty tough with um, Hurricane Michael that hit uh, my hometown of Panama City. Um, so this last, the, the last seven days have been kind of crazy. Um, so let me play you guys a clip that I recorded when I got back from Panama City uh, last Sunday, a week early, uh, and you'll understand why we did a video a week early versus waiting until today. So check that out. All right, so I hoped I didn't have to make this video, but um, apparently I guess I have to. So unfortunately, I already have hit a snag with my uh, Candid Co. And it's not anything wrong with the product. I have to be fully transparent. I had a nightmare morning today coming home from Florida. I've been wearing my retainers every day just like they've uh, instructed. 22 hours a day, taken out to eat. Um, had My alarm did not go off this morning for my flight back to Texas from Florida. And I almost missed the flight. I was rushing like crazy. Um, I had taken my retainers out in the, like on the drive um, to, uh, to drink some coffee and stuff, and I actually left them in the rental car. And so by the time they get them to me, it's going to be already time to switch to um, the second tray. Now on the plus side, you know I've worn them for eight days now. Um, they really weren't that uncomfortable. And so again, I know I'm probably going to catch some flack from friends of mine that are in the dental industry, um, an orthodontic industry, but I'm going to um, go ahead and go to my second set of trays a couple of days early. Now, in doing so, my plan is to wear them a, for the additional weeks. I'm not gonna skip a week of, of time. I'm just gonna go ahead to these uh, second tray a week early and then wear them longer. I did some research online and found that um, a lot of dental professionals actually recommend you wear the trays a little bit longer than the two weeks if you wanted to um, um, versus shorter. So I know it's kind of cutting into the next one, but um, I really don't know what else to do. Uh, if not, I likely have to start over. On a plus side, the tray one, the first set of trays, actually was starting to feel like it wasn't really doing much. Um, they started to feel like they were kind of loose on my teeth, so they definitely have done their job so far. So my assumption is that tray two, I, I already know it's probably gonna be really uncomfortable at first, um, but I don't think it's going to be too uncomfortable. At least I hope. Well, I guess we're about to find out. So um, here's tray two or, or set two. Um, hopefully not too much of a drastic difference, but let's see how they feel. So they're definitely tight. Um, they feel like the first set did when I first put the first trays in. Um, get my chewy out and kind of sit them a little bit. Yeah. Definitely a lot tighter than the first tray was. Um, I actually kind of have a little bit of a lisp now that I can hear. Um, it's not uncomfortable, so to say. It's just snug. It feels as snug, maybe a little bit more snug than the first set. Um, but I have a feeling based on how the previous set went that um, some of this tightness and discomfort should settle down like the first one did after a few hours. Um, you know, after, after a day or two, I wasn't really feeling much with the, the, the first one, which was good. I could definitely feel um, you know, my teeth were moving because when I would take them out to eat, I could actually feel that my teeth uh, were changing their position. So um, tray two started a week early. I know I'm going to probably upset a lot of of people that are in the dental industry and friends of mine that are dentists and orthodontists. Um, but again, I plan to wear these for three weeks versus the two weeks and two weeks um, just to give myself enough time. I don't want to rush this process by any means. I do want to follow my plan. It's just, you know, unfortunately things were out of my, you know, out of my control this morning. I did the best I could. Um, and knowing that I left those there um, in the car and it was just, it was a nightmare morning. So um, 
after having them on for a few minutes, some of this, the, 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 the tightness is actually starting to decrease, which is kind of odd that it's that fast. Um, the few areas that I feel some of the tightness in are areas where I know that we're trying to move the most, some of the crowding and things that I've had or that I have. So those areas I do feel the most tight, they've actually started to back off on the tightness and the snug feeling around the teeth. But um, I remember after the first one, and so just kind of give me some feedback on the first tray. The one place I noticed the most soreness would be my areas where I have crowding. So the front of my bottom teeth, um, they have the most crowding. And then I have a tooth here that um, kind of rotated and sits back. When I would take them out to eat, those areas where the crowding was actually um, were the most sore. So I had the most discomfort there. Um, after a couple of days, that soreness went away. Um, and it didn't hurt, I would say. It's like if I went to bite a piece of food, I would feel some soreness here. Um, but already the, the tightness, that snug feeling of my teeth is already decreasing as I'm continuing to talk um, by quite a bit. So um, hopefully that's a good sign. Um, again, if I can give you any advice, don't lose a tray. <laughs> don't lose a set of them. Don't make the mistake I did. Um, and don't, you know, like I said, I'm not advocating that anyone go outside of their treatment plan that they're orthodontist with Candico sets up for you. Um, just unfortunately, I got kind of dealt a bad hand, but fortunately I did get to wear them for um, over a little bit over a week before I, um, before I had to change. So um, I'm going to put this video into an actual update video that I'll do in a week, the typical two week um, update and let you guys know how these feel after a week of wearing them, even though I had to start a few days early. Um, and hopefully you guys won't make the same mistake I did, but so far so good. So we'll talk to you soon. So there you have it, the mistake I made. Please don't make the mistake uh, that I made by losing one of your trays. Again, um, honestly just tried to make the best of a bad situation. So I've been wearing those trays for a week. They were very, very tender. The next day my teeth were, uh, especially the front teeth where I had the most crowding and where most of the work is being done. Um, but after three or so days, that tenderness, that discomfort, the soreness, around my front teeth settled down tremendously and today is now six days after putting the new trays in and they're already back to feeling like what the first tray felt towards the end. So like I said, I'll be wearing these trays for two more weeks as if I started today even though I started a week ago um, and will not lose these <laughs> and we'll be ready to change on to the third set of trays in two weeks. So. Glad you guys are, uh, are sticking with me on this thing. And again, don't make my mistake. I am not advocating or advocating to, to go ahead in your plan. Um, but I just have, like I said, make the best of, of the, the hand I was dealt. So we'll see you guys in two more weeks.